I am here with the winner, Dustin Poirier. Dustin, first of all, congratulations on a very impressive victory. You and Connor are going. Let's see what he's saying. Go get him. I, I would go to him as well. But I want your thoughts on the fight because the fight was going your way. Obviously, you got him down. You landed some vicious ground and pound. And in the last seconds of the fight, in a crazy freak accident, he misses a punch and breaks his own ankle. He, uh, he fractured it on one of the checks at the beginning of the fight. Then it broke on a punch, yeah, for sure. When I pointed at him at the beginning of the fight, that's when I checked a good kick. I bet that's when it cracked. You felt it. I felt something, but I, I mean, he's kicking me hard, you know? It makes more sense that it broke where it broke in that regard. Yeah, yeah, it was probably cracked, and then just on the twist of the punch, finished, you know. This is a very strange fight, in that the first fight, there was all this animosity. The second fight, Connor was very friendly to you. But then leading up to this third fight, in the, the, the last few weeks, he's made things very personal. Yeah. I can take, you know, like, even the trash, like, there's no holes bar with the trash truck, right? But murder is something you don't clown around, you know, there's no coming back from that. And this guy was saying he was going to murder me and all kinds of stuff. He was telling me he was going to kill me tomorrow. I'm going to leave here in a coffin. You don't talk like that to people, man. I hope this guy gets home safe to his beautiful family, you know? The way the fight was going, clearly you felt like it was going in your way. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, he did hit me with a good cross, just like the last fight. I didn't see it, and he kind of clipped me. Uh, a little bit buzzed, but my legs were still there. Takedown was... He was putting his fingers in my glove and pulling me down to throw the up kicks. I was trying to let Herb know that. This guy's a dirtbag, man. The ground and pound was very effective. And everybody booing? Everybody booing? You can kiss my... Dustin, is this in any way anticlimactic for you, or are you happy about this victory? I mean, dude, you know... Karma's not a bitch, she's a mirror. And, you know, this guy's pressed, said the wrong shit, and I've been busting my ass, and sometimes these things happen. And, nah, I beat the guy. Well, you're a good man. Congratulations, sir. Enjoy your victory. Everybody, go to thegoodfightgroup.com. We're raising money. Meet Justin Wren, Manny Pacquiao. We're raising money to build housing in Uganda for the pygmy people. And also, there's a very special young man uh, battling cancer from Louisiana in the audience named Peyton Murphy. It's an honor to have you in the building, man. You're a real inspiration. You're a real fighter. I can stop anytime. You're a real fighter. I love you, brother. Dustin Poirier, ladies and gentlemen.